This giant hole in the ground 10 miles east of Kersey will soon be a bank to hold water for homes, farms, and ranches in eastern Colorado, areas where water can be hard to come by. It's not about the amount of water we have, it's about the time and the place that we get the water. Drew Damiano was in charge of building this reservoir for United Water and Sanitation District. He says this 5,500 acre foot reservoir, which is about the size of the Park Meadows Mall property in Lone Tree, will only be filled with the amount of water that is in their senior water rights. This just allows them to manage it differently. So what we need to do is store it and utilize it at another time in another place. This kind of project has future generations of Coloradans in mind, and that kind of forward thinking usually takes a sort of visionary. Uh, I've been accused of living 20 or 30 years in the future, yes. Bob Lemke is that guy. His reservoir took five years to design, approve, and build, while he says most reservoirs can spend 20 to 30 years just getting government approval. He says it's because his reservoir design is outside the box. Actually, make that built outside the river channel. It doesn't trigger all the review process because you're not putting anything in the river. You're building it next to or adjacent to a river. Not only is the 70 Ranch Reservoir off channel, but it's also completely lined with polyurethane. That allows them to store water in the sandy soil of the eastern plains. We believe that's probably the future of much of the new development for municipal water that will be needed in Colorado. So this unusual reservoir may be a blueprint for saving more Colorado water in the future. Every year water leaves our state that we could potentially store and use within our state. From Weld County, meteorologist Corey Reppenhagen, 9 News.